Hey friends, welcome back to Civil Engineering Mastery. In this video, we are going to discuss about SAFE software. This is one of the most widely used software for analysis of slabs and foundations. SAFE was developed by CSI and it has the same user interface as like ETAP software. How we are using the ETAP software for analysis and design of buildings. In the similar manner, SAFE also we use for analysis and designing of the foundation and lab. So let's discuss about the basic details about this SAFE software. Without delay, let's begin now. First, let's start with the abbreviation for SAFE. Analysis and design of floor system. Analysis and design of floor systems. So this is the abbreviation for SAFE. It is the ultimate tool for floor systems. From framing layout to detailed drawing production, SAFE integrates every aspects of the engineering design process in one easy and intuitive environment. It provides unmatched productivity to the engineer with its truly unique combination of power comprehensive capabilities and ease of use. This software offers a single user interface to perform modeling, analysis, design and reporting. As like we do in the ETAP software, similar manner we can do the modeling, 3D modeling, we can do the analysis and design and we can prepare the report. A new model explorer is available for quick access to objects, properties and forms. This safe software is unique tool for modeling foundations, basements and footings. We can easily model soil supports and no tension soil model with uplift analysis. The area assignment of soil supports is based on the subgrade modulus and they automatically adjust whenever the mesh changes because this is basically working on the finite element method. So whenever the mesh changes, it automatically changes the subgrade modulus. Basement foundation models can include pedestals, walls, columns, beams, and piles in addition to the foundation area. Design strips are used to define how the required reinforcement are to be calculated. We can define the strips by ourselves or the SAFE software itself can define the design strips for us. The SAFE software includes the ability to define force tensioning in slab as banded or distributed tendons. This is one of the new enhancement in SAFE 2020. An interactive tendon editor simplifies the task of laying out the tendon profile. The tendon layouts can also be automated based on strip position and direct. Safe software offers a wide range of four design features such as reinforced concrete, PT beam, design of slab and, and composite steel beams. They support aluminium frame, concrete frame, steel frame, masonry wall, composite beam, composite column, cold formed frame and steel joist. In safe software, after running the analysis, the deformed geometry can be shown. The deformation values so when we hover into the model, the deformed values can be instantaneously displayed. The deformed geometry can be displayed as filled object or in line contour plots. So by using this, we can find out the deformation values easily. SAFE offers numerous interactions between various CSI softwares and third party products. See the third party tool is IFC and you can use for CSI detailing ETAPS, SAFE 2000, these are all CSI products and CSI Revit. So these are all interchangeable. That means by using these other softwares, the model can be imported and exported from SAFE software. So if we wanted to model something like design something, so if the model is done in some other software and we wanted to use that in the SAFE software, then we can import it to the SAFE. Similarly, SAFE from SAFE we can model and we can export to the other softwares as well. So here the direction is given. If this is the symbol, it is bi-directional. That means we can use in both softwares. This is one way and this is in coordination with ETABS. So friends, that's all about the basic details of the SAFE software. I hope you all like this video. Please do comment in the comment box. Your comments are always welcome. Also, if you like the content, hit the like button and share it with your friends. And if you want to continue further with the SAFE software, please do comment in the comment box so that I can upload videos further about SAFE software. And don't forget to subscribe the channel for more videos. Thank you for watching.